Good morning, everyone. In order to introduce yourself to your teachers, you are going to complete one of the four choices on the introductory choice board. There are four options. The first is to create a soundtrack of your life. I'll explain that one in this video, and then the other ones I will explain more in detail in a different recording. So the first is to create a soundtrack of your life. You will choose eight songs that you think reflect your personality or that you relate to in some way. I've had kids in the past that have um, created their own songs, but most just pick out their favorite songs that they connect to. You'll include the title and artist for each song and then write a two sentence explanation to explain how the song relates to you or your personality or why you connect with it. Um, an optional task is to create an album cover. I usually do this in class, but out of class, I don't know what tools you have at home. So I'm just looking for the songs to be listed. A sample of this is on page two of this document. This is a former student with her list of nine songs with artists and description of how she related to them. The second is an educational timeline about yourself. Essentially, you'll be creating a timeline. You can either use a Google Doc or um, PowerPoint, whatever format works for you. But you'll be creating a timeline about five important events in your personal life and five important events in your educational or school life. And I will go more into directions, which are on page three and four of this document in a different recording. The third option is to complete two personality quizzes and with reflections. So there's a four to six sentence reflection and a two sentence reflection. And then you'll create a character bone structure. Character bone structure essentially is a fill in the blank where you tell me a little bit more about yourself. It gets a little more personal. And again, I will provide a bigger description of this in another recording. Finally, for those of you who just like to sit down and write a lot, my big writers, there's an option to write a literacy autobiography to describe your past experiences with reading and writing and your experiences now. So how you've kind of grown and developed as a reader and writer. I have directions and sample of that on pages five and six of this document. And again, I will go over those in a separate recording. So you need to choose one of these options. Right now, you just want to get into your mind what sounds most appealing to you. You will be assessed using the rubric at the bottom for a total of 10 points. The first thing you'll be assessed on is competence. That is, did you ask for help when you need it, needed it? Did you have independence? So the independence part doesn't mean that you're leaving me alone as a teacher. It means that you are working independently and quietly at home and then jumping and asking questions as needed, either in the chat um, or asking to meet at a different time. And then also, since this is English, we're expecting that you complete the work with correct convention. So it's grammar, punctuation, and spelling. Very important. Um, to meet the at standard criteria, uh, you were mostly independent, completed the work with minor errors, and then it works down from there. The second thing you'll be assessed on is the content and creativity. This first box is left open for the above standard criteria because that is for people who kind of go above and beyond. So the at standard says work is creative, original, and interesting, reflects a unique style or voice presented clearly and logically. Above standard would be something kind of unexpected that goes above and beyond and surprises me. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean that you go out of the box. You might just write a little bit extra or put a little more time in. And then again, that works down from there. Right now, just decide what you think you're going to choose. Like I said, more details for the soundtrack, the educational timeline, an example there, and literacy autobiography are in this document. If you choose option three, the personality quiz, that is in a sep separate document under modules, and you'll have to grab that, and I will go over that in a separate record recording.